All right, guys, here's a little algebra for the real world. If you want to know if, if that, those algebra classes were a waste, well, I always say learning something in school is, isn't a waste because it's exercising your brain muscle. And you want to get that thing nice and exercised and big. And then you can use it in life for whatever you want, even if you forget the things that exercise it, like algebra and some of the other things you learn, trig. But I do think sometimes it's useful. Here's one time where algebra is actually going to come in handy. So I've got this, uh, these three canvases I want to put on this wall right here. And I want to get them centered. So I'm like wondering, how far in do I put it to where it's going to actually be in the middle? Okay, now you could just, I could just call Amanda down here and be like, Hey Amanda, can you stand back and like tell me when this one's in the in the middle? But it's kind of hard with three panels because I can only hold like one up to the on the wall at a time. Be like, Amanda, I, like I can't hold three on there. So algebra actually is going to come to my aid. So what I want to find out is how much in do I have to go to where if I put this thing in up it, next to that line, it'll be in the middle. So basically, I gotta do imaginary line from here to like some spot here. Burp, burp. And this section is gonna be like X. So like, here we go, I'll, I'll put break it down on the wall. So here's the wall, the whole big old wall. And I want, the panels that to be spaced perfect okay so this to this this distance is going to be x and then i want it to be the same as this distance x and then the middle well i got to measure those i did measure these it's 45 inches so that's 45 inches from here to here and then I also measured the whole wall. The whole wall is, how much was it? 114. All right, so my question is, what's this mount right here? Because <laughs> I can just measure in from the wall, put the first one, put the second one, put the third one, boom. Um, and I want it to be the same as this one. So, um, so what I know for sure is X, plus 45 plus x needs to add up to 114. Does that make sense? x plus 45 plus x should be 114 total. So now I want to find out what is this magical number that will make this true. What is x? What is the thing that will work, to the amount that will work to make this work out? So then it's just algebra. So you got two x's. That's going to be 2x plus 45 equals 114 and then you got to move the 45 over there right make a negative so it'll be 2x equals what's 114 minus 45 somebody's good at math here um it'll be 70 minus 169 right i don't know if you got a calculator let me just check that in my head 100 plus 14 yeah that should work okay 2x equals 69 so that now we got to divide this by 2 to get the x by itself divide this by 2 X will end up equaling, let's see, 34.5. So there you go. So if I measure in 34.5 inches and put my first panel and put them all out, it should end up 34.5 from this side. It should be perfectly spaced. So there you go, a little algebra for today. And if I want to get it up and down perfectly spaced, I could do the same thing, measure this and this. And do a little more formula x plus this plus x equals the up and down but honestly i think i can kind of eyeball that one up and down so it's not as big of a space as this one so all right there you go a little algebra for today uh it's not nah, you don't use algebra every day um but every now and then when you're doing stuff around your house um or, or working on a job sometimes it, it can come in handy here's one of those times so there you go later guys